Okay, we've got our head all put together here. We've got our seven pieces, three center, two on each side for the outside. I've added inch and five eighths inch screws and inset them. Same on this side, three of them. We have the back, which we marked our orientation on. So you want to make sure you do that so you know it goes up. Sometimes you might put it in backwards and it might fit all right, but then you find out you're wrong. So anyway, this is going to slide in here. And then this will be the piece that you'll be able to take on and off if you ever have to get inside to make any kind of repairs. These two sides, we marked our orientation so we don't put this on backwards, which it can. It will fit that way, but then you'll find out it wasn't quite right. So you want to make sure you, you put these where they go on the sides and we mark our spot so I know how far down to put glue. And then the right side also. So that's part of the back that goes on and off. Or that you can take on and off if you need to. So we'll set that aside. We also have our mouth. These three pieces will be for our mouth piece. And once they're all glued together, when we get to that point, that's going to go in here for the mouth. So we won't be doing anything with that at the, at the time right now. So we're going to start with getting the mouth glued together. And being that they're small pieces, I can do all three. And one or two, sometimes one clamp is enough. Sometimes you need two. part will get trimmed off later depending on where we put our neck and everything so that's why I leave that long and then I'll cut it down later on when we get to working on the mouth. If you enjoy my videos uh, please like and subscribe on my YouTube page I'd appreciate it. If you have any questions or suggestions or comments put in my comment section I'll get back with you. Somebody suggested using a plastic card to spread the glue, and I find that does work very well. That will go on there. And this piece, we'll wipe, the, wipe the card off. And you need to wash that card off every so often to get that, because that glue tends to, to start to dry on there. So we're going to get this clipped where we want it, put a clamp on that, we'll wipe this excess glue off for now. Again, you're going to have to sand this down to get it to fit in that slot. set this and let it set up real good. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to glue these pieces on our back. You're going to have to sand this down to get it to fit because it's going to be too tight. So we'll start with this piece. And again, I'll put both of these on. side. Then I'm going to put a staple in it to keep it in place. Until 
until I can get a clamp on there. Do the same to the other side. Now, if you don't have a staple gun and you want to put a, you can use a one inch brad nail, will work fine too. You can do that or you can just, just glue it and let it go with that. I've done all three. Holds it pretty good until I can get a clamp on there. We'll clamp that, let it set. Set that aside, let it set up, and then we'll be back. Thanks for watching.